Previously on Lion Moms. Elliot! What have you done? Elliot wasn't the one who destroyed the instruments. Then who did? I did. Please, Claude, please, please, can you, can you please come back? On one condition. I get to do it my way. Did your boss tell you who your new client is going to be? Potential client, but no, still top secret. Mr. Reza? From Elite Flood Securities? You. You're the new client? She's coming! Did you really embezzle the money? Is this one raise a distraction or a cover up? How do you expect the public to trust you? Your court case hasn't been settled yet, so why are you embarking on another fundraiser? I told you I'm not answering questions about those unfounded allegations. This fundraiser is about an experimental treatment for neuroblastoma, a tragic brain cancer that affects children. Children, this drug represents hope. No, no, no. Are you okay? Yeah. How are we getting out of here now? Yeah, for so long already. Yeah, don't come out. Channing Tatum in that White House movie? <laughs> Except she's not a president, she's a crook. Still very impressive. Reminds me of those bodyguards in Korea who looks like K-pop stars. <laughs> That's my razor. But you girls should know, when he came home, he asked me to help ice his shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? Mm, fine. Just small aches when I laugh. You know what, I managed to walk three rounds at a track yesterday. Oh, that's good. Because I need both of you healthy enough to attend the Neuroblastoma fundraiser. No, don't tell me you bought tickets. Is that Kristana woman running it? I don't think so, but Quartz needs to up its CSR profile for the IPO, and it's for a good cause. Yeah, but Jaden and I, we are up to our eyeballs with this new case. I don't think we can take the night off. I don't care. We bought a table, so both of you are coming. Besides, it'll be fun. Actually, one of the Charleston students is doing this treatment. His name is Dermy. Oh, I know him. Um, he was Kai's senior for some science activity. He's got cancer? Stage 4. Seems like there's little hope, but maybe with this treatment... Well, all the more reason to support a good cause. I'm sure Jaden will be fine without you for a night. Stop it! Dr. Lin. Mrs. Wang, good morning. Your son betrayed my son for something he did. Are you talking about Kai confessing to bullying Elliot? It's your son's idea to sabotage Elliot. He used Amos's friendship to force Amos to help him. And Amos is the type that always stands by his friend. But when Kai confessed, he threw Amos under the bus. <laughs> is that your idea of integrity? To sell our friend? Mrs. Wang, they did it together. So they are both guilty. Because of your son. My son now has a black mark on his report card. He won't be a prefect or hold any leadership positions now. I'm sorry. But they both have to learn to bear the consequences of their actions. Of your son's actions. My son was just being a good friend. And as a Charleston alumni, you must know how important friendships are. How powerful connections are the most important factor to getting ahead in life. Thank you for your advice. I've had a first-hand experience of powerful connections and 
It's overrated. My son did the right thing and I'm proud of him. Maybe you should teach your son to do the same. Have a good day. Then, Mr. Pause here. Go for your lesson first. No, 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 no. Shh. Oh, okay, okay. Hi. Ooh, what's this? Wow. This is great. Well done. I'm just going to give you medicine. Okay, let me see. Uh, Mrs. Rani? Yes, Claude. Um... Uh, hold on, hold on. Dina, Dina, Dina. Matikan dulu, matikan dulu. Yes. It's... It's been a little difficult doing the lessons here in the living room. There's been a lot of, uh, distractions. I'm scared that it's affecting her focus. Do, do you have a study that we can do the sessions in? Oh, yes, 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 we do. Uh, Nups, can you show Mr. Clark, please? Let's go. Okay, thank you. Shh. Okay, okay, Mummy's gonna give you medicine. All right, let me just grab the medicine over here, sayang. This exercise is all about memory and to test your powers of analysis, okay? So I need you to pay attention because I'm going to have you read this and then after that, I'm going to ask you a series of... Okay, you know, this won't do. Come on, on your feet. I'm sorry, Mr. Clark. No need to apologize. Must be that pizza that you had for lunch. Come on, let's get some blood circulation to the brain. Come on, up. All right, now you just follow me, okay? I do this with all of my students when their energy gets low. You ready? Okay, now let's just jog on the spot. All right, let's try and fix this. Fix your posture, right? Okay. Okay, so make sure this is strong, all right? Okay. It can't be just flimsy. Okay, and just spread these up it. Make sure you're nice and grounded. Okay, ready? You all right? Yeah. You okay? There you go. Okay, down. Good, very good, very good. Alright, now, down, down. Was fun. <laughs> yeah, good. Maybe now you'll be able to concentrate better during English. What for? My mommy doesn't get me any reward because she thinks doing well is its own reward. But that's unfair, Mr. Claude. All my friends get rewards from their parents. Well, maybe you're not asking at the right time, you know? You gotta catch your parents when they're in a good mood. But she's never in a good mood. My baby brother is always crying. Okay, uh, why don't you try asking your dad? You don't have a handphone, right? You could try asking for one. You know, there's a lot of educational things you can do with it. There's learning apps, math games. That sounds fun. Just remember to ask your dad when he's in a good mood, okay? There are two antique walking sticks and a safe deposit box that they're fighting over. <sighs> Crazy rich people. Guess who's got Indian food? Yay! Picked it up on the way back from court. Oh, it smells so good. <sighs> I hope you bought enough because it's going to be a long night. We have more asset listings. Aren't you supposed to be at home taking care of your baby or something? Uh, raise us at home. Can I tell you a secret? Harris has colic and he cries all day. So I'm kind of staying here for as long as I can. I'm a bad mom, right? <sighs> don't be silly. Everyone needs a break. Here, why don't you let me handle those asset listings for a bit and you can rest your eyes. Here we are again. 
online, you just have to be with you. Such a familiar sound. Mommy yeah. always brings us nasi lemak. Mommy is not here tonight, okay? She's doing well. I don't like it! Hi, girl. For beauty and wellness. Yep. Miss Sim, you're the most awesome teacher for letting us use our phones in class. Only for you to play educational games like Hangman. Technology is a big part of education as well, especially for digital natives. But some of us don't have phones. Only cool kids have phones. My dad gave me his second-hand phone. Miss Sim, what does this word honourable mean? Honourable. An honourable person is somebody who is worthy of your respect, who is brave, who stands by his friends. You mean someone I can trust being friends with? What happens when someone is no longer honourable? Then he is a coward who betrays his friends. A traitor. So when Kai betrayed me to Miss Chang, does that mean that he is a coward and a traitor? <laughs> what do you think? Alright, enough of that. Amos, bring my things to the staff room. Class dismissed! So you got a phone? Wanna join our Riot Boys chat group? You're including me? Sure. We play online games with each other and beat the enemies from other schools. I'm not supposed to play games with my phone. That's an agreement with my dad. Okay, forget it. Wait! Now I understand why you spoke so highly of him, Colonel. Brilliant idea using the delivery bike. You rode in like a knight in shining armor, saving the day. You still have to pay for the horse. You'll see a charge of $200 on our next invoice. Riza was my best man in the army. It's completely honorable and dependable. Mm. Just doing my job, sir. Now, perhaps we can get back to discussing about the assignment? As you know, I'm launching a fundraising campaign that will bring a neuroblastoma treatment to Singapore. Fundraising? Again? Yes, an even bigger event. So, I'm going to need you to provide event security leading up to the gala and, of course, security at the event itself. But I think we are not the right... I have decided to increase your retainer. Some of the sick children will be there for treatment with their parents. $200,000? That's very generous of you. Yes, but since the court case, I have been receiving email threats daily. Even though the drug trial is a completely separate case, this drug trial is so important because it may be their last chance. Their cancers are nearing an end. So I really need the best security money can buy. But <clears throat> wouldn't your assets frozen? No offence. I mean, I heard it on the news. I have some very generous supporters. They believe in the work I'm doing. Well, 
I guess that's that. Thank you very much, Dr. Kristana, for your business. Well done, Riza, for securing such a big contract so early into your job. Perhaps you can show Dr. Kristana a dossier of our experienced bodyguards. someone like that. I didn't do anything. I don't care, just give it to me. Give it to me. Well, what's happening? Hey, Kai. Who got on your desk? Who, who did this? It's about how bad you are at the game. Yeah, you don't want to admit it. What's wrong? It's true, isn't it? Make sure you don't ask kind of play mobile gamers with you, or you will all lose. <laughs> you want back in the group? Then prove it. How? Oh. Show us how badly you want to be in our group by doing the washing pot challenge. Huh? Eat it. No. You want to play with us, right? Eat it. Record this. I knew you couldn't do it, chicken. Guys, he's a coward. Kai is 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 a coward. Oh, yes. Is that good? No, sure. not even a single bee. So proud of you, Zayan. Thank you, Daddy. I'm still working on getting to GP. I'm so glad you got your mummy's brain and not my sotong one. <laughs> so, how can we celebrate? Mm, I've been thinking and... I want to get a phone. Many of my friends have gotten their parents' old phone. A phone? Yeah? Why would you need a phone for naps? There are so many things you can do on a phone. Educational games, learning apps. Are you even allowed to have phones in school? As long as you don't take it out during class hours. But you're only in P3. I don't think you're ready for a phone yet. 
Ya, yeah, ada dangerous content on the internet. You are too young to understand, sayang. What's wrong? Uh, it's Dr. Kristana. I gotta go. What's wrong? I woke up and it hurt. Oh no. Yeah. Let me see. Yeah, if you have a stiff neck, you're not gonna get any blood to the brain and you won't be able to concentrate. Better? Yep. All right. Let's switch to language arts. Take a look at some poetry, hmm? Poetry? Yucks. It's so boring. Boring? You like pop songs, don't you? Yeah. Well, pop songs are like poetry, only without the music, you just focus on the words and let them paint a picture for you. You see, poetry is a way to make everything sound beautiful. Like you, Nabila, a noble tree, tall and proud, who generously shade the ground. That's your name. It means noble and magnanimous. What do you think? It's nice. Anyway, I noticed that you were sad the other day when your mom didn't get you a reward for your excellent grades. So, here's a reward from me. Books are rewards. Of course they are. I used to love this book when I was a boy. I hope you like it. Thank you, Mr. Claude. Yep, uh, I'll send the contracts over once it's ready. Thank you. Hi, uh, Mrs. Joanny. Hi, Claude. There you go. Thank you. I'd like to talk to you about an app I recently developed to enhance GP prep for my students. Oh. I think Minnie mentioned to me about that before. It's Go Jeep or something like that? <laughs> yes, that's right, Go Jeep. It's like a game, but it challenges them with mental sums, vocabulary building, helps keep them sharp, and it gets them used to GP questions so they don't stress out when they take the actual test. Right, but Nabila doesn't have a phone. Oh, okay, uh, no problem. I, I tell you what, why don't I install the app on your phone and then you can take a look at it and see whether or not you think it's suitable? May I? Sure. Okay. There you go. Thanks. You, know, you should try answering the questions when you receive them. Some of them are pretty hard. I'll think about it. Thanks, Claude. Sir, if you need anything, just give me a call. Okay, Ken, thanks. Welcome. These jokers couldn't even spell it right. Who cares? Why did they do this to me? What did I ever do to them? It's just pain. They can easily fix this. No one was hurt. I'm frightened, Reza. They knew which car was mine. They know my email address. If they could hack into my email, then they know where I live. Reza, did you hear me? They hacked it into my computer server. Okay, I'll send over my tech guy to your office to take a look at it, okay? It may not be related to this, all right? How are you going to catch them? Maybe. <sighs> There's nothing much you can do here. Why don't you just go back to your office and wait for my tech? Black Beauty. Have you read it? It's written from the horse's point of view. It's called anthropomorphism. 
Wow, that's impressive. Did Mr. Claude teach you that? Yes. Um, Mummy, can I go for riding lessons at the saddle club? Riding lessons? You don't have time for that, Nabs. But it's interesting. I really love horses. They're so beautiful. Just lessons during the holidays, please. <sighs> Nabila. The June holidays are so short. And horse riding is very time consuming. I can keep up. Please, Mummy. Horse riding is not even a DSA subject, Nabs. You still have to focus on your badminton, your GEP, on top of your regular school. Why can't we just go to the zoo and look at the horses? It is not fair. You never let me do what I want. Hey. What's happening here? Mummy won't let me learn horse riding. She's already got too much on her plate. Oh, okay. Well, maybe exposing her to a new activity is useful. After all, she's only going to get busy in P5 and P6, right? So who's going to send her for this new activity? You? Look, I was just saying, it's good to be well-rounded. You know, learn new things. Yeah, learn new things. Right. <laughs> Why can't you just be on my side for once? Huh? Why are you always making things so difficult for me? What? What did I do? I just thought... I can't deal with this now, okay? I'm going to the office. I was on a date nearby. I just came to get my tablet. What are you doing here? It's my office. Oh, yeah. I mean, why are you not at home? Is everything all right at home? The baby? Is it Reza? Forget it. I'm just... I'm here for the peace and quiet. Hey, is there anything that I can help you with? Is that alcohol I smell? Yeah, I was on a date, I told you. Is that lucky girl? She's just someone from the gym. Anyway, look, how about I get you a coffee? It looks like you could use one. I think I need one. I'm gonna go to the washroom. I'll be back in a bit. Durani's phone. Uh, who is this? Where's Durani? Uh, this is Jaden. Uh, she just went to the bathroom for a bit. Why are you picking up her phone? Where are you guys? At the office, of course. Look, do you need me to get her to call you back? What? The... Forget it. I'll talk to her later. All right. Thank you. You know what? Since we're already here, might as well get started on Mr. Lim's case. Okay. Were you with Jaden? Yeah, we were at the office. I called you earlier. He sounded drunk. I ran into him at the office. I think he was on a date or something. What's the big deal? He picked up your phone. He didn't tell me you called. Maybe I was in the toilet. I'm going to go check on Nabila. Uh, 
I can't believe I can't even answer a P3 question. Why is your phone quizzing you? It's that GEP prep app that Claude developed. Oh, is he using it with naps? I should get it for Kai too. Yeah, you should if you want to fry your brains. <laughs> it's so tough. Last night, Jiren and I was like looking for the answer online for 20 minutes. Can you believe it? Two lawyers and we can't even answer a P3 question. Malu not. Can we go back to the last night Jaden and I part? We were working late last night. Okay, if you say so. Anyways, I'm wondering whether I should give Naps a phone so she can try out the app for herself. But do you think she might get distracted? Well, Marcus and I had the same conversation before we got Kai one, And so far, we haven't run into any problems. Kai has a phone? Mm -hmm. Did you have to watch him like a hawk? <laughs> That's his father's job. No, the only thing he's not allowed to do is play games. So you think it's okay that they are not too young? Well, what really convinced us was that Charleston is letting their older students use tablets in class. And we wanted to keep Kai competitive. Big action. Look good. Look good. Mm. Right? Yes. No smile. No smile. Sharper eyes. Yes, yes, it can be good. Okay, don't smile, don't smile, don't smile. Okay, good, good. Hold, hold. I'm zooming into your eyes. Yes. See your abs. Yes, see. Razor. Reza, you need to be part of my personal protection detail tonight. I'm sorry, this is not how we work. <clears throat> I'm the GM and I'll select... I am paying top dollar for this? Somebody's trying to kill me. You saw my car. You need to be the one to lead the team. Look, I'm in charge of planning, strategizing, and selecting the best men... You are going to be part of the six bodyguards tonight. I insist. Or you lose my contract. This is a huge responsibility for your age. We trust you and we don't want you to abuse this trust. We are giving you your own phone so that you can use Mr. Claude's app to help you prepare for GEP and other schoolwork. But we have our own conditions. Please read and sign this contract. <laughs> stop playing with my documents. You need to stop using the phone by 10pm every night. Okay? I promise. I'm so glad you joined me out for this. I haven't had a fun night out in a while. Well, it's for a really good cause. And I think Dr. Gee has had a lot of success in Canada. Mm -hmm. Hi. Dr. Christiana? Yes. Congratulations. But check out Dr. Christiana's bodyguards, though. Reza had to hunt high and low for them because she insists they're actually at least 1.75 meters tall. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Miss Ho, thank you so much for your kind donation. We are so fortunate to have Quartz as a sponsor. Is your partner not here tonight? Oh, no. Mr. Chang is overseas. But these are some of the mums from Charleston Primary. Oh, Cindy's friends. Hello. Hi. I'm so glad I could lend my husband for such a worthy cause. I haven't been seeing him around ever since you became his client. Um, Reza? Your bodyguard? Oh! <laughs> Reza, you never introduced me to your wife. <laughs> she is lovely. Ma'am, I'm on a job here. Not to socialise. Your husband is marvellous. Without him, my enemies would have succeeded in destroying me. <laughs> oh, if you would excuse me, I see some guests I must say goodbye to. Thank you.
for Reza. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Congrats. Thank you. Congrats. Thank you for coming. Yes, Miko. So, <clears throat> we're almost done with the night. Can I trouble you to sign this? Sure. Thank you. I just want to say thank you, Reza. The evening went off without a hitch. And the cancer kids, thank you too. I really hope more children can be saved by this treatment. You know, I think the media may have been wrong about you after all. I get my strength from the people I help. Who the hell are you? You know that this is spelled with a T, right? What do you want? The police already has this footage. It's just a matter of time before you are charged. Charge? Charge me for what? I don't understand. I didn't even do anything. This video shows that you vandalized the car. Mister, this is not vandalism, okay? This is for a street game called Earth's Adventures. Any idea what is it? They just hired me to do the tagging. Things for the PR. See my IP address? 13 out of the 20 we managed to trace, definitely the same IP. Different sender each time? Yeah, but they were all really easy to set up. They were all created on the same day too. The other weird thing is, do you remember the email you had me look at at the skate park earlier? Yeah, what about it? Same IP address. What are the odds? Maybe we got lucky. Can identify the bugger after all. Okay. Let's do the reverse lookup. Maybe you can find the physical address. Okay. And why are you with... Reza, I, I could ask you the same question. What are you doing here? I've been investigating your death threats, your car vandalism, and they all led me here. Zing Zang Media. You... Did you set all this up? You caught me. <laughs> I don't understand. Why would you do such a thing? Don't be so naive. The embezzlement court case was hammering me. I needed to turn the tide of public opinion in my direction. The ends justify the means, don't they? Did you really think that we would have raised that much money for the drug trials if I was still bogged down with all that negative press? You use dying children to get publicity. What kind of monster are you? Those children wouldn't have had my help if it wasn't for that publicity. Besides, I didn't do anything illegal. So done with you. I'm firing you as a client. I'm going to tell everyone what you have done. You signed a contract. You took the retainer fee. You signed a binding, 
non-disclosure agreement. Ask your lawyer wife what that means. So if you say anything to anyone, I will sue the pants off of you. And that's a promise. So keep your pretty little mouth shut. Ronnie and Mr. Jaden closing <laughs> to be he wearing not, in a courthouse. He house. did not speak like he that. Did. He did. Look at the worst lift in the world. He was so mean. I just had the worst night. When I come to pick you up, there you are flirting with your office boyfriend. I've had enough of this! We weren't flirting! He was just joking about that. What happened? Let's talk in the car on the way home. solution for you. <clears throat> you don't have to be enslaved to the evil witch. You can step away without penalty. Just forgo the final payment. If not, you can force her into arbitration and she'll have to reveal everything. But the non-disclosure? You can't go public about her. But there's one thing you can do. What? See, the NDA is between you and her foundation. But she forgot about the neuroblastoma trial and Dr. G. So, you can do this. You work all night for this? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go shower and I'll send up to school. No problem. Dr. William G, who was heading the neuroblastoma cure program, has been called in for questioning by the Medical Health Board for failing to disclose severe side effects in the experimental drug treatment. In a stunning reversal of fortune, after a successful fundraiser, the program has been shut down pending further investigation. Dr. G's key partner in the program is none other than the beleaguered Dr. Kristana Johnson from the Kristana...
My soul spills into yours and is blended. Because my soul has absorbed your fragrance, I cherish it. Every drop of blood I spill informs the earth. I merge with my beloved when I participate in love. In this house of mud and water, my heart has fallen to ruins. Enter this house, my love, or let me leave. Good night, sweet dreams. <laughs>